By definition, if it was something you could predict, you would be operating at the same level of intelligence, violating our assumption that it is smarter than you. If I'm playing chess with super intelligence and I can predict every move, I'm playing at that level. It's kind of like my French bulldog trying to predict exactly what I'm thinking and what I'm going to do. That's a good cognitive gap. And it's not just he can predict you going to work, you coming back, but he cannot understand why you're doing a podcast. That is something completely outside of his model of the world. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't even know that I go to work. He just sees that I leave the house and doesn't know where I go. Buy food for him. What's the most persuasive argument against your own perspective here? That, that we will not have unemployment due to advanced technology? That there won't be this French bulldog human gap in understanding and, I guess, like power and control. So some people think that we can enhance human minds, either through combination with hardware, so something like Neuralink, or through genetic reengineering to where we make smarter humans. Yeah. It may 